everyone and welcome to my channel. My name is Christian and this is CXC Beauty. So today's video is going to be a behind the scenes. I'm going to show you exactly what I use for my filming equipment, my lighting, my backdrops, uh, even my editing software. I've gotten a lot of requests on Instagram and Twitter uh, from different people asking me how I make my videos and all of that stuff. So I thought I'd do a YouTube video showing you kind of like a, a quick rundown of kind of the equipment that I use and all of that. So if you like this kind of video, go ahead and subscribe to my channel. And don't forget to hit the notification bell so you never miss any of my videos. Also, give this video a thumbs up. I would greatly appreciate it. And without further ado, let's get into the video. Okay, so I'm gonna try my best to show you all of my equipment. I might switch from main camera to some of my iPhone footage. Since I only do have one main camera that I use for YouTube, I'm gonna probably switch back and forth so you guys can get like an overall good view of everything I use. Uh, so. I'm gonna use my phone as well as my main camera and I'm gonna take you through the equipment that I use. So first and foremost, I do wanna say, in order to start a YouTube channel, you do not have to have all this equipment. I started my YouTube channel with literally an iPhone 6 that had 16 gigabytes. Um, I would record and it would fill up like this. I would empty the files into my computer, delete, and then record again. I had two lights at the beginning and then I would just use a backdrop with a, a sheet on it. Um, and I would do my friends' makeups, my makeups, uh, cleaning my brushes and videos like that. All shot on my iPhone and then I would edit them on iMovie. And that's how I started. And if you really want to start a, vi a YouTube channel, the most important thing is to just start. Record with what you have. Um, at the end of the day, it's all about you and your personality and content that you're going to put out there for your audience. I'm gonna show you now what I used to make my YouTube videos. First and foremost, I use my camera here. This is my main camera and it's a Sony a7R II. So this is my camera. See, it's a mirrorless camera. This one is full frame and then it has this lens. Um, it's, a wide, it's a wide angle to zoom lens from 28 millimeter to 70 millimeter. And it's a great lens. It's a kit lens. Um, I never upgraded it. I use this one as well as a 50 millimeter 1.8 lens. The second tool that I have that is very important to me in making YouTube videos uh, it's, is my microphone. So this is the microphone I use right now. It's the actual audio that you're listening to coming from my mouth right now. And this is a Yeti, a blue Yeti microphone. I got this one at Best Buy and it has increased my quality of audio so uh, so much and I really re and I really love this microphone. I used to have the blue snowball microphone and if I find a picture I'll insert it here but it was a, another one and it was really good too and these microphones are USB microphones so you do have to connect it to your computer to make it work but it's definitely worth the money and the hassle of having to <laughs> connect everything like that. Sorry for the mess, but I've gone handheld because I want to show you my lighting. So I use two of these LED panels. I got these on Amazon and if I can find the link, I'll link them for you. So there's one here and one over there. And then I use this light over here with, uh, it's like a softbox umbrella and it's uh, an LED bulb. It looks like that. And that's my main light. And then for my backlighting, I use these two light bulbs, which you can get these at Home Depot. And then I use color gels and that will color my backdrop. So this is my backdrop. I got this on Amazon. And then this is a seamless paper. You can get these in many, many colors. I also use fabric backdrops. So if you look right here, I have a bunch of different fabrics. We have the sparkly ones and different colors. I use all of these backdrops to change my background. And then another great tool that I have, and this is not necessary. Um, I have this because I do those kind of artistic style videos. And this is a gimbal. This is a Ronin S by DGI and it's a stabilizer. So this is what gives me all those smooth shots. And when I do side sweeping motions in my videos, this is the device that helps those smooth, smooth shots. Okie dokie, and then another very important tool is gonna be, of course, my computer. So for editing software, I use Final Cut Pro 
on the Mac. So if you look here, this is the software I used to edit. Um, I also love to use DaVinci Resolve, which I do have on this Mac. And then I also use this computer over here, which is a PC. And this has DaVinci Resolve as well. Another really cool part of my setup is, I know I can't zoom out that much, but another really cool part of my setup is my desk here. Um, these are the Ikea Alex drawers. And um, this is one of their tabletops. And what we did is we just joined the tabletop and the Alex drawers. And then I put uh, wheels on this. So if you see this rolls, and it has wheels. So it's like my little mobile command center and I can just roll it over there where I store everything because my desk is currently full of a bunch of other stuff. <laughs> but I roll this desk over under that TV and that way it's like a little mobile command center. And then I also use this monitor which is attached on an arm like this and then I can see myself filming or I can swing it back to where Tony can see and then he can check if I'm in focus and record with the camera. But it's very nice to have like this screen, that way you can see everything. It's like a giant viewfinder. And then this arm thing helps not have it on the table and then you can also move it and keep, the, keep it clutter free. Okay guys, so that is the whole setup. That's like my little mobile command center. Um, and then I just sit here on my desk and that's how I do my YouTube videos. Okay everybody, so that is a little insight on the equipment that I use to film my videos. If you guys would like me to do an in-depth video on how I edit everything, maybe color grade my videos, because I do shoot in a flat profile and I'll get into that in an editing video and how to shoot everything. So if you guys want an in-depth video on how to edit your videos, how to color grade your videos, how to film in different formats and all those stuff, the different softwares that I use. Let me know in the comments below. I would be more than happy to explain that to you guys and show you guys all the tips and tricks. But this is the end of this video. If you enjoyed this, again, please give me a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to the channel. I had a wonderful time with you guys, showing you guys my equipment. That's another thing that I love. I love tech and I love all things film and photography. So, I really enjoyed this video with you guys, and I will see you in my next one. Bye.